I'll never forget that my grandfather and half we moved out from Pedro and we lived down in Long Beach. I think it was on Elm. I was real young. I hadn't even gone to school yet. My grandfather and uncle and my dad, they built a house in North Long Beach on Hewlett Street. But here, six of us, little one bedroom home, one bathroom, one closet. It was small. I'll never forget during the Depression. My mother and dad went out to a party someplace. So we thought, well, we'll make a cake. We got the stuff all beat up and it didn't look good or nothing. So we had to get rid of the battery. Well, that was during the Depression. So I said, well, I'll bury it out here by the lilac bush. And would you believe it? That lilac bush never did bloom. <laughs> And then a year later, here it started to bloom. I had a good job. After I got out of the Navy, and it took me about a year to get going. I was a welder for 42 years. People knew me, so I didn't have a hard job finding a job. Dear Laverne Olson, Mr. <laughs> Just like you, it's not every day we know someone who is turning 100. Welcome to the 100 Plus Club. Thank you. Well, here's looking at you. There's been a few bumps in the road. Some roads that wasn't so bumpy, but I look and thank God for every day that I'm alive.